From movies to logos to commercials and everything in between, mermaids have caught the popular culture wave. Pun intended! But how did the world become so enamored with, well, this? Mermaids and creatures like them have been a source of fascination for centuries, and millions of myths surround them in a web of watery lore. Pirates wore gold earrings so that they would always have something valuable in close reach in case a mermaid ever mugged them at sea. In Japan, the ningyo was believed to hold the key to immortality, and an Irish Catholic saint is even said to have started life out as a mermaid. Fish-tailed and watery-dwelling people are fairly common subjects of primitive art dating back thousands of years and spanning the globe. But one of the most commonly accepted myths of how mermaids entered Western culture has its roots in Homer's Odyssey with the sirens. The word for siren and mermaid is interchangeable in many European languages. Originally, though, the sirens were bird women who lived on rocky cliffs on an island called Entemusa and wooed sailors at sea with their enchanting music. Doesn't that sound familiar? Anyways, after losing a singing match to the muses, the muses stripped the sirens of all their feathers to adorn themselves, jerks. Unable to fly and not dig in the plucked chicken look, the sirens, not knowing what else to do, converted their bird parts into fishtails and sank to the men at sea from the waves and the rocks surrounding Antimusa. Antimusa is said to have been located somewhere between Sicily and mainland Italy, but it's unclear whether it's really the Napoli down island of Capri, one of the smaller, rockier outlying isles or if it ever even existed in the first place. Mermaids were always a common stock character in fairy tales, good and evil, with entrancing song and often beauty, helpful or fatal to men at sea, omens of fortune and misfortune, sometimes with wish-granting or even healing capabilities. But the most everlasting mermaid tale is inarguably Hans Christian Andersen's The Little Mermaid, which for almost two centuries now has been told and retold in countless incarnations. The 1980s saw the film industry busting out countless flicks about mermaids such as Splash and Walt Disney's The Little Mermaid. It made mermaids into a subject for millions of young girls to become totally obsessed with during the 1990s, even when they were no longer that anymore. Duh!